Way to honor our veterans. It certainly looks like they had wonderful weather today in North Charleston. I did step outside, of course, and notice it's a little bit hotter than that fall weather we get on, got on Saturday. So. Yeah, that was thanks to that sunshine that warmer. came out. Mm -hmm. It helped heat us up just a little bit more. There also, I don't know if you noticed, was a touch more humidity yes, out there back. as well. That led to a few more showers. Yeah. Tomorrow going to be very similar, but if you're heading out for dinner tonight, most of us are mainly dry after those showers we had roll on through. However, I am watching a few showers right along the coastline. They could hang on and make their way into southern Charleston County. I'm looking at Seabrook, Hollywood, and southern Charleston. We could see some of these showers within the next hour or so. I'm not sold on it just yet, but I, of course, will keep you updated if those do push on shore. Temperatures? Fantastic out there. Check this out. We're talking mid to upper 70s inland, 80s along the coastline. Absolutely gorgeous weather. There is a touch more humidity. You're definitely going to notice that as you step out the door this evening. You're also going to feel it with those overnight temperatures tonight. We're going to hang out into the 70s, upper 60s as you're heading out the door tomorrow morning. Again, a little bit warmer than what we woke up to this morning. We'll see mostly cloudy skies that will help hold those temperatures as well. But all eyes are on our next approaching weather maker. A cold front that will swing through tomorrow afternoon into the evening hours will bring another chance for some rain, but check out those high temperatures into the low 80s. I'll show you those rain chances for tomorrow and where you're really going to feel that cool down coming up in your full Storm Team 2 forecast.